Hey guys, it's Jacksboro123, and today I'm here with Neo. Hey guys, how's it going? Marry my channel, please. Marry it. Marry your channel? Really? Really? Is that even legal? I don't know. I think it might be in America. Uh, Thank you, Trump. <laughs> uh, Anyways. Let's not go there. So, uh, we got, um... I got on the modded server, and this is what I have. I have Axel, my Diplocolis. I have Birdie, which is an Apex Pterodon, and Call, which is a Apex whatever it is, Argentavis. And then I have an Allosaurus and a thingy right over there. Parasaur. Anyway, so we're going to set up my base and kill a bunch of stuff pretty much this episode. Yep, I think that's the plan. So let's first of all find a place to build our base or my base. Okay. I'm thinking of Lead building. Away, a... Mon Capitan. Yes. Uh also we are on giant blue monkeys. Or giant they're, horses. They're like horses. <laughs> Calicatarium. Oh gosh, that one shot on the tree. <laughs> oh man, that tree didn't even see it coming. Just saying. <laughs> the damage is real. Look at that damage. 39,000. Oh, yeah, you, you just got a like double. One. Double kill. Oh, oh, the see, rock. The trick is, is lining up your shot. Yeah. Oh. If we kill a bunch of dragonflies, does that count as like a quad? Penta kill, kill, <laughs> kill. <laughs> Maybe I could build my house literally right across the water from yours. Yeah, if you want to. Yeah. Okay. First of all, I gotta make sure I have the building materials on me. Dive, dive, Rauga. <laughs> Oh gosh, there's an Ixie. It had bad mm -hmm. intentions. <laughs> no, not the Ixie. Anyway, so pretty much I got a bunch of Pokeballs and the plan for this season is to catch them all. Quite literally. Okay, let's see. Triple kill? Or just one kill? Yeah, oh. double kill. We like one shot Brontos and stuff. To explain how I got this guy is I saw the giant monkey or giant horse and I threw a Pokeball and it hit and I caught it. I will quickly show you guys how to catch something which will be this Bronto right here. And then I probably shouldn't have just threw a rock at it. I was Ooh, half I hoping that rock was going to hit. Oh, well, you might need a Bronto. Oh, there we go. GG. And there is our Bronto right here. And go! Brontosaurus! I don't think I caught it. Oh, yeah, it came. Yeah, it's right there. 104. That is the worst level. <laughs> Literally, we have level thousands, and that's just level 104. It's still a Bronto, though. Yeah. Gather all the berry. I would have rather gone for a stronger Bronto. Okay, so we need wood. Wait, I already have wood, don't I? I have thatch, uh, hide, and metal, and fiber. We go back. <laughs> I can go back and get some. I, I have plenty of wood. Okay. I'll sit here and throw rocks at poor little innocent dodos. Okay. I'm sorry uh, about Ooh. my FPS to my viewers. My computer's pretty sloppy today. There's it will... a Apex Terran and Anadon heading your way. Oh. Kind of a nice color. It does look nice. And now I gotta figure out what level it is. 
Oh gosh. And I can't get over there. Darn it. Does the poop do damage? I don't know what it does. I've been trying to figure that out myself. Oh, it doesn't do damage. Darn it. Oh gosh, I harvested something. I harvested two things. I feel horrible. Well, you know, if you don't clean it up, it's just gonna sit there and rot, so. <laughs> yeah. Sky Boulder, it's Russian Roulette! And does. No, nothing died. We need to find an island with a bunch of dodos, and then we can build a uh, bowling alley. <gasps> yes! That would be the best thing ever. Elegant Therapy and bowling. Oh, yeah! Oh, yes! That uh, pterodon that you were talking about just landed. It's a level 640. Oh, I don't fully know the levels and stuff, but to me, that's a good level. Oh gosh, yes, I got it. <laughs> 640 is not bad. Yeah. The Titanonic was slain. How good is this? I believe that would have been uh, some Tack and Mago. Yeah. They're off killing stuff. Oh, hi. Yep. So, uh, what? Would you pass me some... that wood? Yeah, it's on the Calicatarium. He is the keeper of the wood. He is the keeper of the wood. Structures, and. Now we gotta find the structures plus structures. I think it's just in wood. Yeah, found it. Uh, wow, my FPS is tanking over here for some reason. Yeah, my FPS was being grumpy, or is green being grumpy? Okay. So we gotta get rid of this turtle. He's in the way. I got He's it. Did you just punch it to, to kill it? Yeah, pretty much. He's one punch man. One punch. One punch. And oh no, the turtle shell's too tough. <laughs> I lied. What is this? I want to see if I can one punch. <gasps> It was more or less five punches. More or less. Dodos are tough. Well, wait, you can go invisible. Oh, I thought that was oh, yeah. a comp chasing you. And that was about the freak. Oberaptor. Giant Oberaptor. Is it alpha? No. Are there That's even alpha? Just an Oberaptor. I, no, I don't think so, anyway. There might be. There's a lot of weird stuff in this mod. Even John Cena, the dinosaur. Well, there are the titans. <laughs> Normally, I start off my series by building a ship, but the ship didn't work out too well. Oh gosh, the FPS just <laughs> screwed up this one plank. Uh, yeah, um, yeah, the ship. Which one? Uh, the first ship screwed up. Did you have ship failures too? No, no. Well, sort of, but not not in your uh, not in the way yours failed. Mine's still over there. Oh gosh. Oh oh. Oh gosh, what level is it? I don't know. Okay. It is uh, level it, it 220 is. or something. Yeah. B20 male. 
Interesting. So it's... I am the destroyer of quetzals. Feel my so... fury. <laughs> we gotta fill this Dude, whole thing in. I think you have a sunburn on your legs. Wait, what? Oh. Yeah. <laughs> 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 Wasn't that from you painting me? Maybe. I might have did that while you were laying unconscious in front of my base. Yeah. I was busy chilling with my axolotl. Yeah, I, you know, I'm the jiggly puff of arc, so don't be caught sleeping around me. The Jigglypuff powers awaken only at night. Large wooden wall. Oh yeah, dude, they're awesome. Uh, they're like three walls tall. Extra large wooden wall. Mm -hmm. Which is the size of the behemoth gate. Oh. Oh. Well, check that out. Well, we have Put a our couple house of wall. those down, and now you have a yeah, <laughs> yeah. Put a couple of those down, build a tower, and put some stairs in. Got a good vantage point. Now, how am I going to get my dinosaurs in here? Um, you know, dino door. Dino door. Other than your Bronto. Yeah. Have like my dinosaurs able to come in and out of the house. Yeah, honestly, that's what I usually do when uh, I'm starting out. Know, is I'll build the wooden dino door and uh, or dino gate, and incorporate that into the build. Oh. I ran out of uh, wood stuff. Wow, I brought you like 4K. I know, right? Hmm. Okay. Let's I see. Have... Uh, oh yeah, I have drones. How good are the drones? Um, they start out kind of weak sauce, but they're kind of cool still, though. I mean, like, uh, you can get a uh, you can get R two D two out of them. Really? Yeah, it's pretty cool. What the heck is wooden fence support? Oh, dude, those are awesome. Uh, you know how like when you're building a uh, Walls around your base, how they usually come out all uneven and crap. Those do not follow the terrain, so you can have a nice, perfectly even wall. Oh, that's awesome! Yeah, yeah. Thank <laughs> you. 
There we go. Oh. Well, there is a bit of an entrance. But that's not always bad. You still there? Oh my gosh, it's beautiful! Oh, well, now you need some curtain. It might be a real house. No. I might need a ceiling too. But you have the skylight and you know, and see <laughs> all the stars and I like the weirvins uh, and the manticores and dragons can stop in. Yeah, you know. <laughs> not not no issue, you know. Giant dragon. Come, come on, on in, in, have a cup of tea. Come on in. Now that I'm thinking of it, I don't want to make the ceiling. Okay, let's see how Billy sits in here. Eh. Oh, he'll grow into it. Yeah. <laughs> okay, time for the Bronto. <laughs> Give him a saddle. Not yet. Oh my. Watch it, like, spawn right beside us. Well, you know, the Titans do like to spawn on the other side of my base. You want to go kill it? I got a Pokeball. <laughs> if, you know, if you get close enough to it with one of those, I I'm kind of curious <laughs> if you can catch one. Let's go. Go, but, go, you know, power. Pokeballs are just a, a little bit on the, um, on the, um, OP side. Oh gosh, the FPS is real. Mine's back up now. Yeah, it just went up when I started crossing the water. Oh gosh. Did you just attack a Stego? Who's in my way? So I smacked it. No, my way, man. I'm throwing a rock at them. So you can't catch stuff that aren't tameable with the Pokeballs, can you? Theoretically, no. I say that because some things, depending on like if it's a mod or not, um, you can't tame them normally, but, but it lets you with those Pokeballs because they're the mod creatures and coded quite right. Okay. Oh gosh, my RG's freaking out. Everything, yeah, so is my Tapahara. And the Rex is just looking out of the cage like, well, what's going on out there? <laughs> He's like the shy guy who's like, I don't know what's going on. I have a laser helmet. I'll let you guys handle it. What level is that Quetzal? <laughs> it landed right on top of your house. Right next to my other Quetzal. Hmm. It's Destiny. Oh gosh, that's yeah, a level that one thousand. Hmm? That what this one? Yeah, the quetzal that I knocked down. Oh, is it male or female? I'm unsure, but uh if I don't get up to the ceiling in time, just knock it out again. Yeah, okay. Okay, I'm up. Oh wait. This one's level 780. It was your Quetzal that I saw. But 780 <laughs> is still a good level. Yeah, it's not bad at all. Now I just gotta wait for it to get up. So that I can throw a Pokeball at it. This is how you catch them all. I prefer doing it the old fashioned way. Yeah. No! I missed. Okay. 
Well, now he's inside of an easier place. Except I think it fell through the floor. Um, I caught something. Catch one of my dinos. No, I literally caught nothing. <laughs> huh. I just picked up the pokey and it was empty. No Pokemon whatsoever. Okay, where is that Quetzal? There it is. Syntax Jr. Oh yeah. Mind you, Syntax Jr. is a female. <laughs> this thing's huge. Did they increase the size of the Quetzal? Yeah, they did. Wow. Let's uh make sure I don't catch Syntax Jr. I don't think you can with uh, that ball. Oh yes. Come here, Pokeball. Okay, let's make sure I don't put him somewhere where he'll get stuck. Or it will. Hey, another Quetza. Mm hmm There we go. Now what level is that one? Uh, I'm not sure. It is a level 180. This guy came out at a pretty good level. Not bad stats either. Nice. Not as good as Billy, but we all know that Billy's a beast. Maxing Ooh, him. I think I see the Titan Dragon. Actually, I know I see the Titan Dragon. Where is it? In the center of the island. Really? Oh yeah, dude is huge. So I guess you're flying around right now? I'm on my Tabahara. Okay. I'm on my Pterodon. Here. Oh, I was gonna say, just hop on. Oh wait, yeah, it's a dual seat. <gasps> wait, I can throw a Pokeball at it if you fly up close. Uh, we can try it. Okay. Experiment gone wrong. It, oh, yeah, this this is this is a horrible idea. Oh yeah, this is definitely a horrible idea. <laughs> okay. You think you can outfly it if it gets mad? Maybe. Maybe. Okay. Let's hope it doesn't aggro <laughs> us. Just fly up behind it. Oh, dude, if it aggroes us, we're, we're so dead. Yeah. It aggroed us! I don't have battle music. I do. Ow. Where is it? There it is. Is it flying away from us? I think so. Do it now! Come on. Come on, Dragon. Get in the Pokeball. <laughs> <laughs> We're just chasing it around the island. This is a horrible, horrible idea. Oh, it's stuck. I don't think the Pokeballs are actually going anywhere. I, I don't think they are either. You want? Oh, that Pokeball almost hit it. I think it do doesn't go if you're like f moving. 
Wait, no, it goes behind us because we're flying fast. Yeah, let me get underneath. Yeah. Now stop. Or let me get ahead of it. Right here. Oh gosh! Oh, you caught my. What? What? What just happened? What the heck? I think you just caught my Tapahara. But I shouldn't be able to, should I? I don't think so, but I'm not even sure where I'm at. I just was instantly on the ground. I'm inside of the air. Um. Yeah, I'm really high up in the sky right now. I see the dragon, <laughs> still. Well, that's the thing. <laughs> um, so, experiment gone wrong, question mark? Where's my Tapahara, man? <laughs> I don't know. I'll owe you a new one. Is that dragon. Holy, what the? Oh, I see the dragon. There it is. Yeah, I'm like right above the island. I am now. I'm flying. Wait, how are you flying? Oh yeah, the jetpack. Yeah. This is such a bad idea. I'm going to try and land on its back. <laughs> You're going to land on it? I'm gonna try. Anyways, I've got to end off the video. I have chores to do. So, if you guys enjoyed the video, please be sure to hit the like button and comment down below what was your favorite part. P go subscribe to Neo because he does a lot of good videos. A lot of funny stuff, you know. Anyways, see you guys. Oh god, it's going to eat me. It's going to eat you? I think so. Oh no. Mistakes were made! <laughs> I see the dragon just stopping. Yeah, it left me alone. Okay. <laughs> Bye! Later, everyone.